Good morning, Bulldogs. This is Brendan. I ask that you please rise for the reciting of the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Good morning, Bulldogs. Today is September 27th. I'm Alicia. And I'm Savannah. And we're here with your daily morning announcements. The tutoring lab will be back in the IMC starting today. The tutoring lab will be running Monday through Thursday, and you must be in the IMC by 3.10 in order to participate. See you then. Do you, have, do you love the world around you? Are you interested in finding ways to help it? Well, if so, stop by and learn about the Central Conservation Club. Come to our first meeting on September 28th. We will discuss the chances to go out hiking, camping, canoeing, cleanups, and other outdoor activities. We'll be meeting in room 223 at 305. There's a hosted meeting in room 323 this Thursday, September 28th, after school. Don't forget to bring your dues. Attention all girls interested in playing softball this year. There's a mandatory meeting during CAP this Friday in the cafeteria. Important information will be discussed. Hey, graphic designers and artists. We are looking for a breast cancer awareness bulldog logo to go on a t-shirt that will be sold in the spirit shop. Get your designs in by room, into room 113 by next week Friday. Here's Leslie Torres with a message about National Heritage Month. What's up, guys? It's Leslie Torres, uh, part of the Orgullo Latino Club, and I'm here to talk about the Hispanic Heritage Month. And so each year, Americans observe the National Hispanic Heritage Month, right? From September 15th to October 15th. By celebrating the histories, cultures, contributions of American citizens whose ancestors came from Spain, Mexico, the Caribbean, Central, and South America. The observation started in 1968 as Hispanic Heritage Week under President Lyndon Johnson was expanded by President Ronald Reagan in 1968. To cover a 30 day period starting on September 15 and ending on October 15. It was enacted into law on August 17 in 1988 on the approval of Public Law 100 402. The date of September 15 is significant because it is the anniversary of independence for Latin American countries like Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, and Nicaragua. In addition, Mexico and Chile celebrate their Independence Days on September 16 and September 18, respectively. Also, Columbus Day, or Dia de la Raza, is October 12, falls within this 30-day period. Another known fact. Did you know that there's 1.2 million Hispanics serving our country right now? Bet you didn't know that, huh? Wow, that's quite a statistic. Thank you to all who served or have served our country, and thank you to Leslie for teaching us more about the National Her Hispanic Heritage Month. Hall sweeps will be coming back soon. When a hall sweep occurs, teachers will be closing their doors as soon as the bell rings. Students who are late to class during the hall sweep will need to go down to the cafeteria to sit. From there, your name will be taken, and if you get hot, hot in the hall sweep more than two times, your parent will be contacted and further consequences may occur. Long story short, be on time and don't get swept. Any girls interested in gymnastics, there will be a parent meeting at Hale on October 3rd in room 116. Please enter from the west parking lot facing 117th Street. Seniors, WCTC will be here tomorrow, September 28th during CAP. Stop down to student services to sign up. Attention Bulldog family, our football game on Friday, October 3rd has been chosen at the WISN 12 Football Challenge Game of the Week. We are competing in a food drive against New Berlin West to see which school can collect the most food. Feeding America at Eastern Wisconsin is a beneficiary of the food drive and they work with 600 plus members, organizations, helping the one in seven people in our area facing hunger. You can help by placing items in the donation boxes found in the Lincoln Street Central Lobby, Central Cafeteria and the Central Office starting February, September 29th through Thursday, October 5th. Please bring in peanut butter, jelly, tuna, cereal, canned fruits and vegetables, canned soup, mac and cheese, pasta rice or other non-perishable food items to help our community. The winning school gets a $500 Meyer gift card and bragging rights. Winner will be announced before the game and highlights will air on WISN 12 News at 10 p.m. on Friday. Let's go Bulldogs in the entire West Dallas community. Let's work together to solve hunger. 
And that's the rest with your morning and daily announcements. Go, Go Bulldogs! Bulldogs.